has something to share with you, Kara? It's always fun that I have something to share with you. I will tell you later. First, I'm gonna set Benjamin in his chair <laughs> and then I'm gonna tell you everything. Yeah. But really, everything. <laughs> we are the Feel the Breeze family. And our dream is to travel around the world. To explore and discover the beauty of Mother Earth. And to in the end, find our home somewhere on this amazing planet. We made it our mission to inspire others to live the life their dreams. And we do this by sailing across oceans, driving landings on land, and documenting our lifestyle. Good morning. Dada! 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 Good morning. You want to join me? So we started driving and we have a friend we met many years ago on Instagram and his name is Sebastian and we knew he uh, and his family they own a house in Alt Aussee so we called him yesterday and he said yes it's no problem you can park on my at my property to have a good night of sleep and this morning he texted me so you can find the keys and uh, if you need the house and the house is really beautiful. Look at this. Thanks, Sebastian, for, uh, for your hospitality and your help along the way. Um, we know you feel the breeze for a long time already, but this is, uh, this is really amazing that we can, uh, uh, can we stop over and uh, make use of your property. So thank you very much. Where is Benjamin? Benjamin, it's not raining anymore. Fish. No, it's not raining anymore. No. Yeah. Yeah, we can throw it away. This place is so beautiful. I'm just checking now at the back if everything is closed for Benjamin not to escape so we can sit just very quietly with no anxiousness about uh, Benjamin escaping. And that's the case, it's totally surrounded. So everything's closed so Benjamin can't walk away so we can sit and relax. Oh, Benjamin is doing the garden already. Are you helping Seps out, Benjamin? Okay, we just finished breakfast outside and the sun is disappearing a little bit. Um, but we did our first essentials of life, eating. And now we're gonna unpack a little bit and freshen up and uh, then we're gonna do a house tour with you guys. Okay, so I did a really quick shower because I forgot that the water needs to heat up in the house a little bit before we can have a warm shower. So the warm shower will be tomorrow, but I'm fresh, clean, and uh, had another cold shower experience. So uh, Stephen, you're gonna be proud of me. Um, yeah, but uh, I prefer the hot one. So we have to unpack our stuff and there is kind of a James Bond feature in this house. So winter time, riding the sleds, some wood for the fireplace. And here, this is for the wood going up. You can also use it for the um, for your suitcases. And here is storage and the cellar. 
and then we go up again. Hello. Welcome to the Alt Outsay Lodge. Hello, man. Well, welcome. This is the main entrance. Uh. And here we have the beautiful stairs upstairs. And if we go here, we have the living room. And this is quite spectacular. Here we, here we stayed for four days. Yeah, and if we go upstairs, we'll show you where we slept. Yeah, there's the nice fireplace. Four bedrooms quite similar. The one that there's the master bedroom, and then three quite similar bedrooms. And we stayed over here. Yeah, we had the morning sun here. Yeah. We chose this one with the morning sun. With the morning sun. And, and a beautiful it? view. Yeah. And then we have the bathroom. And this is where we enjoy our first proper shower after a week in the Land Rover. <laughs> So, do you recommend Alt Ausse Lodge? Oh, definitely. It's beautiful. Yeah. Everything is beautiful. You feel yeah. like home over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can rent it on Airbnb. did a wonderful yoga session and uh, afterwards we're gonna go um, do some hiking around here in Alt Ausee and there's got to be a beautiful lake so we're gonna explore that a little bit and I think Benjamin is gonna start waking up in 20 minutes so a quick shower for me and then uh, we're off to go. Hey darling, what are you doing? Well, I'm making some bites, some snacks for during our hikes. And uh, I think they will be delicious. And what is it? What's inside? Well, it's a recipe for Earthy and Andy. And we follow them on Instagram and they do a lot with the vegan recipe. And in this one is peanut butter, hemp seeds, oats, um, dark chocolates and uh, some vanilla. So we're going to take it with us? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go for that walk, finally. Fair is picking up some stuff to, um, to show me what the, how we can manage our walk. And there he is. Ta-da! <laughs> what is it? We've got boots. Really good boots. We've got a hooker pack, hooker pack, so we can put your balls you created, you can put inside and we can take it with us. Because the owner of the house, Seps, he told me that fast weather changes. <laughs> so we have, he said, there, there are ponchos. But I believe that when we are on the top of the mountain, we can, we can go down. <laughs> Hi darling. Hi. Almost ready. My carriage has arrived. Yes.
tricky. There's a small tree and we don't have an X. So uh, we have to go back, unfortunately. We are a, a bunch of amateurs. <laughs> without going off road, without having an X or a motorcycle. We're going to a waterfall and an old castle near a ruin. Yeah, and we thought we could travel by car with Lily, so we tried. But then we came on a piece of off-road, but we couldn't go any further because of a tree. something to share with you, Karen. It's always fun that I have something to share with you. I will tell you later. First I'm gonna set Benjamin in his chair <laughs> and then I'm gonna tell you everything. Yeah. But really everything. <laughs> Bye. It has something to do with the drone? Yeah. No, 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 no. A waterfall yeah. and something. So we were walking down the, um, the waterfall and then at a beautiful spot, I was thinking, maybe I can fly the drone. And Jan is at the exact the same moment, maybe it's a good spot to fly the drone. And I said, yeah, right. So I started unpacking it. I was a little bit anxious because there were a lot of trees and, but I figured out a way how to go up on an open spot, go down and started filming. So that's what I did. Plan worked out fantastic. Rihanna and Benjamin were cheering on me. They said, "Wow, that's fantastic! You're going, you're nailing it." Uh, you did actually did a good job. It was already smooth along the way with the waterfall yeah. up high. Yeah. And then I was almost at the top. And then, and I think because of some breaches um, yeah. and trees he lost it I lost uh, control and um, and it was hanging and I started panicking because it's already terrifying flying a drone near a waterfall without a lot of experience uh, I'm not a, a drone commander um, so I lost the drone yeah and I started running like a crazy guy trying to find it. <laughs> it was really funny. Rihanna calmed me down a bit and she said, okay, let's see, where is it, where is it? And you were just figuring out all the, the possibilities. We were looking at the latest footage it shot by your iPhone so yeah. we could see what it's shot and then I recognized the place. But it's a little bit down from the waterfall. So you, I think I could manage it climbing down without a rope but I don't know if I can climb up but if you make one misstep and you fall one half meters the wrong way you fall down and I think you're dead or at least you have all your bones broken yeah. so it's not something uh, we should try without safety lines and things like that um, yeah so I'm in the mood to uh, have a harness and a line and climb down uh, but Gerben doesn't want to lose me yet so uh, we're gonna look for him Mountain. A mountaineer. A mountaineer. mountaineer. Yeah. But I, I, you're really in the mood to go down. And 
on one hand I really appreciate it but on the other hand it really scares the beep out of me. Okay, just uh, met the neighbor of uh, Sebastian. His name is Stefan. He's a real mountaineer. He is here from Alt Aussee. And he just came back from work. But he is so very kind to help us out. So, uh, hi Stefan, say hello. Hi. So let's see if we can, uh, or that we, if he can find it. So uh, he's our hero already. Here it is! I think so! You're a legend man! No problem, no problem! Thank you so much! So, I'm exhausted! This is the neighbor! He just built his house in 14 months. He's a real mountaineer. He, he does rescues 100 times a year here in the mountains. And yeah, he's fit as hell. And he walked up the mountain to the waterfalls. And I had to uh, walk behind him as a little puppy there. <gasps> but uh, yeah, he did an amazing job. And we've got the drone back. And it seems everything is working. So what probably happened is that one of the... Oh, the one uh, Sorry? One prop is broken. That's why he, he went like this. Yeah. That's what happened. Okay. We now, now know now what happened. know what happened. So we're going to check it. If it's um, everything is working again. Otherwise it needs a repair. But Gabriel is our friend from Israel and he said okay guys I love your adventure so take my drone to travel around the world and uh, bring it back to Israel. So we are on our way to Israel as well but this guy has a lot of adventures already and yeah when we break it we got a new one. The sun is shining the weather is good Yes, and Benjamin likes it Yeah, and I like driving in the mountains All the small roads it's And the, and the houses over here in Alt Aussee And uh, we're going to do some errands And this is probably our final day in Alt Aussee and then we will head to Vienna tomorrow. So, first one and a half week traveling as a family with our Land Rover Defender. Yeah something different than sailing yeah totally different and at the same time very similar i think yeah yeah how was it for you yeah well the first week was pulling the land rover uh going off the grid and i really liked it yeah it was amazing me yeah. too me yes. too i love sleeping on the on top of the land rover yeah and in the nature and and meeting new people and the campfire we had and yeah I love it. Yeah, it was beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, and now we are here in this uh, fantastic lodge. <laughs> and this is uh, this is the no, yeah the other way around. So. Yeah, yeah. So totally different again, more luxurious. Yeah. Uh, but we loved it. We did some amazing things here as well. Our first real off the road experience, exploring waterfalls, hiking. Uh, Having a beautiful romantic night in the in the bubble uh, bath uh, outside. Hot tub. The hot outside. tub. <laughs> yeah. It was amazing. It was feels like home over here, and with the hot showers, and we slept 
like babies and especially Benjamin, he slept like an ox. So we enjoyed some wiener schnitzel over here. <laughs> yeah, some real Austrian food. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so we're packing up our stuff now. We've been here for uh, three and a half days. Uh, we're going to Vienna. Uh, yeah, to Vienna, to the big city. Yeah, and why are we going to Vienna? We're going to Vienna because we're going to meet the owner of the house. Yay. We met on Instagram several years ago. Um, and now we are here in their house, uh, but we haven't met yet. And a good old friend of mine, he is living in Vienna as well. So we're going to meet them, yeah, him and his family. Yeah, so tonight we're going to have a beautiful dinner with the family who owns this house. And uh, we're going to keep it there. Yeah.